Everybody, it's Tyler here at the Honda Signature event, checking in with 19589A Hope Robotics. This team, by the way, super high ranked at the Mall of America event and looking for big things here at Haunted as well, too. You got to take a look at what Hope Robotics brings. I really like the overall robot. Their kicker area up here looking so good on their last match I just watched. Got to love the intake as well, but their lift is really cool. So keep an eye out for that coming up here on Pips and Parts. This video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following. The Robotics Education and Competition Foundation provides fantastic programs for students from elementary school all the way through college. These include VEX, Aerial Drone Competition, Online Challenges, JROTC, Girl Powered, Scholarships, Certifications, and so much more. To discover these exciting opportunities, visit recf.org and get connected. Clay, there's a lot to break down on this robot here, uh, going from your, your kicker, your lift. You got wings on your bot as well, too. What do we want to start out with here? I'll start with the kicker. Let's show it off. Okay, so our kicker is a 25 RPM catapult. It's on a double slip gear, so we're still able to have a quick match load cycle. We can do about 22 try balls in 16 seconds, so that's pretty competitive um, at competitions. Um, the kicker is mounted on a four bar, so whenever we're being played, whenever we're being played defense on, we're able to raise that up and shoot over other robots. Um, so whenever it's raised up, it's about 25 inches tall, um, and it also doubles as an elevation. So we're able to go up to the horizontal hanging bar and passively hang on that. Do you want me to show how to do that? Yeah, let's see how some of this works. And one other thing I'll ask you too on here is that with going up that high with your kicker as well too, have you been able to be defended against yet, having that sort of uh, height? There's definitely some really tall blockers here. We saw one that's probably as tall as I am. So we can probably shoot over most robots, but something like that we're probably not able to. Cool. Yeah, let's demo it off. Show me how it works. And in your code that you have, it's just always when it's at full elevation, it's always just going to keep kicking no matter what? Yeah, so when it, we, have a but, we have a button program to turn the kicker on and raise the four bar up, and we also have one that just raises the four bar, to, four bar up so we can hang and then we can also match the tri balls. Um, and talking about your wings and your robot show, uh, talk to me more about uh, where, where those are and how the packaging works for all that. So our wings are use on the longer uh, the new v5 pistons just because they're able to be further away from the fulcrum of the pivot point of the wings so it's still stronger but they're not locking so they do have a little bit of give just hold this button so whenever they're out like that we have a wingspan of around 35 inches so in skills whenever we match load all 44 tri balls over the barrier we're able to go over there and plow multiple tri balls into the goal at a time without breaking the double possession rule. So that gives us, it saves us a lot of time. How did you all do the uh, skills at Mall of America? Our Mall of America robot was a lot different. Our skills, we essentially just ran our catapult just because we could shoot into the goal from the match load zone. So we did pretty well. We got around, yeah, we were six at Mall of sure. America. We got around 15 in the goal in skills and driver. But, you know, as you know, competition keeps getting more and more fierce here at Haunted as well, too. So we wish you best of luck on the skills competition. Love the improvements uh, that you've been doing on your robot as well. Uh, Caitlin, I also noticed you got an awesome uh, intake on the front here. And I'd love to hear more about your chassis as well, too, and what's that, what that is uh, comprised of. So for our intake, it's a vertical intake. We do start with it up, so it has the ability to move up and down. But we're just able to score when our alliance is match loading, or even after we're done match loading, we can go over and grab a tri ball in the front of our intake, kind of like this and it's able to hold the tri ball like that until we're able to get closer to the goal and then we can sometimes push in a couple more with it at the same time. Well overall uh, from chassis wise I gotta ask you when you're looking at designing everything um, I know you got the eight wheel uh, omni wheels going on with it as well too uh, what kind of like drive chains and configurations did you consider when you were approaching this game? So we wanted something fast, really fast to get around the field super efficiently. We also knew that we had to be able to go over the barrier, so it does great with that. It's six motors, it's 360 RPM, and we're able to um, navigate around the field really easily, especially when defense is played on us. So we can move around really fast and do that super efficiently. Well, 19589A Hope Robotics looking absolutely phenomenal here at Haunted Second Signature event for you this year. So we wish you best of luck here as well too. Can't wait to see what you bring to the rest of the season. Thanks a lot. Thank you. This video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following. 
The Robotics Education and Competition Foundation provides fantastic programs for students from elementary school all the way through college. These include VEX, Aerial Drone Competition, Online Challenges, JROTC, Girl Powered, Scholarships, Certifications, and so much more. To discover these exciting opportunities, visit RECF.org and get connected. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to stay up to date on our new videos. Keep the conversation going and provide your input to our content. Most live shows can be found on the First Updates Now YouTube channel, live competitions at twitch.tv slash firstupdatesnow, and join our Discord at discord.gg slash firstupdatesnow. Check our other social offerings on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter.